Good morning, good people. It's another What's in Cadence's lunchbox. And this is what's in her lunchbox. So, we have chips. These are just your ruffles. We have these as kids for the kids to snack on, and I just took a few out of the bag. So, cheddar and sour cream ruffles. Um, we have some celery and cucumbers with some ranch pickles for her sandwich. I've already put mustard on her ham and cheese sandwich that I did pre-assemble. This is gonna be a short week. She did have um, one of her sandwiches. One of the days they were out of school, she had basically her lunch breakdown, but yesterday she did not have the lunch that I pre-packaged. And I pretty much figured they were gonna miss quite a few days this week, so I only made two sandwiches, luckily. So this is the other sandwich. And in here we have pineapple and oranges. Little clementines are already peeled. And um, a Nutri-Grain bar for snack. And then, excuse me, and then we have her Apple and Eve 100% very very juice. I got this um, watch my uncut haul if you haven't but it should be on the Sam's uncut haul and this came in a multi-pack with three different flavors so she'll be drinking on those for a little bit. Today's Thursday she only has one more day this week to go to school so tomorrow um, we'll see what we have. Okay good people so this is how we're packaging it. I just put another silicone liner over her fruit because it's so close to her sandwich and then I'm not gonna put a silicone liner over this one because this is all vegetables and this has the top snapped on it make sure it's good and tight that has the top snapped on it her chips not gonna put anything over this and her juice is here on the side I have her ice pack at the bottom this is how I'm going to start doing it now so all we gotta do oh yeah and I have her Nutri-Grain bar up here. So all we have to do is pop that top on and we are good to go. Good morning, good people. I'm here with Cadence's lunch and it is essentially leftovers. She asked if she was gonna have enough for leftovers last night. I pretty much figured she wanted it. So here we go. I warmed up some of the grilled chicken uh, tenderloins. My man grilled last night. We had grilled wings, grilled chicken. We had um, cheesy, hot and cheesy ranch potatoes. So I warmed the tenderloins up for her. I warmed the tenderloins up for her and put them in full already. They taste so good. It tasted like steak. It is chicken, I promise. Um, and then I have her container of the cheesy ranch potatoes. Now the beauty of this is I put it in a separate container, not only because it just would be easier for her to eat, but if she did want to and have time to warm it up, she could just take this container out and pop it in the microwave and not have to worry about putting the whole container in there. Of course, not the aluminum foil. And if she did not have time to warm it up or want it warmed up, she could eat it cold like a potato salad. So it's perfect. Um, I have a half, about a half, a little bit less than a half of a clementine in here or a cutie. And I also have some sliced carrot of carrots. I'm tired. Some sliced strawberries. And then I have her ranch dipper over here. And then I have her celery up here. So, um... Oh yeah, we also have her apple juice, which I forgot to put in the fridge last night. So um, I'm gonna pop that in the freezer until we leave. So prayerfully, I don't forget that. And then she just has her fork for her potato salad. Everything else she can essentially eat with her hands. If she wants to eat the chicken with the fork, of course she can. But all she has to do is unfold this out of the aluminum foil carefully and just dump it in the tray and eat it out of the tray or eat it out of the aluminum foil. Either way, doesn't really matter. But I think that's what we're going to do for lunch today. I was thinking about packing a neutral grain bar, but she has these potatoes. I don't want her to have the itis at school, especially on a Monday. But this is a good meal for Monday motivation. She'll be excited knowing that at lunchtime she's going to get to eat this. And that will help make her Monday better. Okay, guys, this is a glimpse of how I'm packing it today. I forgot these um, Go-Gurts, these little yogurt tubes. Well, they're not Go-Gurt because they're a great value brand, but it's a tube of yogurt. Completely forgot that I keep forgetting that I have these because I usually keep them in the fridge, but I'm doing this 
freeze thing where you freeze them and by lunchtime they're thawed out. And it will double as an ice pack for this side of her food. So I will be putting the Gogurt in here as well. And I wanted to show y'all that. Let me pop the top on it. I have hair to do. So we will see y'all another day this week, hopefully. So I usually do not record Cadence's after lunch videos anymore because she eats so good, but the past two lunches she has had a little leftover. I can't remember what she had leftover last time, but it was a tiny bit. But she had chicken left and she had potatoes left. I guess it was just maybe too much. I don't know. Um, she's not home tonight because she's getting her hair braided and she has a Girl Scout so she's sleeping over my sisters and um, she'll ride to school with her but this is what she has left. Got a good bit of ranch too but all her celery is gone, all her fruit is gone. She had a good bit of protein but I'm surprised. I thought this was going to be like totally empty, cleared out and I'm having an issue gauging how much ranch so I might have to start measuring it out and putting it in here because I guess I'm putting too much but just wanted to share this was lunch Monday this is what she has left happy Wednesday we're back to see what is in Cadence's lunch box today and it is a semi homemade lunch but semi helped in prep so it looks like a lot but it's really like a bunch of snacky food so I put some apples and strawberries in here I put it in this container this morning instead of in her cupcake liner because I don't want her crackers, ham, and cheese over here. I don't want her crackers to get soft. So that's where we have uh, the fruit. But she's gonna eat it with this, um, what is it called, biscoff. I showed this before in a haul. She's using this cookie butter. So I gave her apples and strawberries and a knife for her to rub the uh, biscoff on there. Cause it's not, we kept it in the refrigerator. So it's kind of hard. And by the time her lunch cools off overall, it's probably still gonna be a little firm. So she has a plastic knife to just spread her cookie butter instead of trying to dip it. Then with her Lunchable, her ham and cheese Lunchable came two of these cookies. I guess it's just like a lemon cookie, two lemon cookies. And then I added her vegetable, which is celery and cucumber, her ranch dip over here. She has a yogurt um, tube, a gogurt, but it's great value brand, which is frozen right now, but it'll be thought out by lunch. And then she has a fruit punch, apples, apple and Eve, 100% juice, and that's lunch for today. Okay guys, this is what I'm packing it like. I'm not going to cover this up. I'm not going to cover this up. I'm not going to cover this up. I did close this of course. Close her wrench of course. Her juice is over here. Her yogurt is over here. And her knife is up here. We will just put the top on. And we're going to head up. See y'all. Good morning. Happy Thursday. This is Cadence's lunch. It looks randomly blank over here. But I have her fruit today as a banana, and I don't want to cut the banana up, and it can't fit over here, so it's weird. It might be able to. No. Okay. She has a sandwich. There are two slices in here, and this is ham, spinach, mustard, um, and a little cream cheese, because we are out of sliced cheese, and pickles to snack for the sandwich, however she wants to do it. Got some chips from the, um, what is that, sour cream and cheddar ruffles. Um, then she has her yogurt, her berry berry juice. She said it's not very sweet, but I've had the juices, and to me they're extremely sweet. It might be because I drink mostly water all the time. I don't really do drinks and juice very much anymore, because to me all juices are like so, so, so sweet. I think it's fine. So she's going to continue to take those. And then she has a smaller banana. But anyway, this is her lunch for Thursday. She asked specifically for a sandwich today. So that is what she received. And I'll show y'all in a second how I packed this in the box. So I packed it in here. And I managed to get the banana in there. Oh yeah. So I got her banana in there. And I kind of put the pickles on top. Now this is not going to be the tightest, I don't think. However... 
her lunch box is pretty tight, so it'll stay closed. It doesn't have any room to move around. I have her juice over here and her um, yogurt over here as well. So that will be today's ice pack, her yogurt, and that's all for today. So talk to you later.